A very good morning and welcome to the Quick Boat Show 2023. If you didn't know, Crick Boat Show is the number one boat show here in the UK and it's where all narrow boaters come and people that are looking to buy a narrow boat or interested in the canals, they come and they visit and uh, yeah, they uh, well enjoy the day. It's not just boaty bits and pieces for sale, there's funky stools or even electric bikes. There's loads of different things you can see at the Crick Boat Show. Fancy a new pair of sunglasses or even a funky hat? It's all here. So the Crick Boat Show is in full swing. I've decided to have a bit of a rest and go out on a narrow boat cruise, which is a bit ironic because I have a narrow boat anyway. Really, it was just me being lazy. I wanted to sit down for half an hour. It's a different water and the sun's shining, so why not? But actually, it does make for a pleasant little cruise and the weather was just absolutely perfect. All I needed was an ice cream or an ice cold beer, but that was gonna have to wait. This is the Leicester Arm of the Grand Union Canal. It's actually a beautiful bit of waterway. I met some really lovely people who were sat on the bow with me and we were having some really nice conversations. It was great just to pass the time having conversations and enjoying the beautiful scenery. That's one of the things I love about this boat show. Safely moored up and on with the show. It's amazing, you can turn around corners and there's something that will surprise you. Like this band, they're brilliant. Well, it used to be a job centre, now it's a bar. I said, oh my God, has it gone this far? Has gentrification come to S E A? It's the opening night and I can't be late. DJ's rocking out. I was here yesterday but I didn't really get very much done because I was too busy chatting to friends and uh, <laughs> and meeting people. I'm sure you'll recognise some of my popular vlogging friends. Any excuse to have a cheeky beer or two. And of course catch up with old friends and new.
Oh, I'm not even touching that. Oh. <laughs> I'm here today to look for a crash cover and uh, yeah, generally uh, look around the places that I missed yesterday. Isn't there always something at a show that you missed the first time around? These floaty homes certainly caught my eye. So these are called floating homes and they are absolutely brilliant. I mean, this one, this is a double. I can actually see myself in one of these. And there's a couple of sites actually not far from me. Uh, there's one here, I think, at Crick. And there's also one at Buckton as well. <laughs> Buckton Marina. So they're actually in between me and that, that would be quite ideal. But these are, these are gorgeous, really, really nice. Of course, Crick isn't Crick without checking out a few boats. From ultra modern to classic, there were lots of boats to look around. Each with their own personality. And then there were the types of boats you could only dream of owning. The show also extends out onto the waterway and it's great to come over the bridge and have a look at all of the boats. Part of my enjoyment of coming to the Crick Boat Show is to walk along the canal side and have a look at all the boats that are moored up um, for the visitors that are here that have come by boat and it's nice to see all the variety of boats along the canal side and uh, yeah all the different names and just a nice quiet walk it's a nice retreat from the show as well because my head gets in a bit of a spin so it's nice to clear my head and just get a bit of fresh air for a little while if you are looking at all the boats remember to be respectful these are people's homes recognize this boat of course, it's Slow Patrol from the narrow boat that James built. Anyone recognise this boat as well? <laughs> She'll kill me for doing this. So that was awesome, actually walking along the side of the canal and uh, seeing all the other boats. And uh, yeah, I stumbled across James from the narrow boat that James built, and he's a real top guy. Um, we had a little bit of a chat and uh, introduced each other. Well, I introduced myself to him because uh, he's got way more subscribers than me. But uh, yeah, really, really nice and a really nice chap and uh, lovely to see. And that's what Crick's all about is meeting up with people, fellow YouTubers and yeah, people with the same interests. It's absolutely great. I just love this weekend. It's lunchtime and I always head for the hills and just retreat from the show for an hour or two. I've got lots to think about. I've had some lunch and I've just escaped and there's this gorgeous meadow full of buttercups. It's absolutely beautiful and uh, yeah, the perfect place to unwind and just relax, get my head back together again. And it does help, it helps me focus and uh, it helps me go back into the show refreshed. I was toying over the quotes that I were given for the cratch cover and the pram hood. That's why my head was in a funny place. Oh, I have to focus sometimes. Surprisingly, the CRT stand wasn't very busy. Now this is something I would like, especially for my photography. I just love these barges. They have so much character. In second place, Morning Star by Oakham. Yeah. 
Morning Star is Paul and Anthony's brand new boat from the YouTube channel Narrow Boat Unlocked. I'm just taking another look on Paul and Anthony's boat. Paul showed me around yesterday and it's just simply stunning, but I didn't actually take it all in. But it's such a beautiful boat. The finish, the Oakham's finish is just phenomenal. It is, oh, it's, it's, it's of a class of its own. It's just beautiful. windy along here. One thing I love about the Crick Boat Show is actually meeting everybody and uh, not only have I met friends and other YouTubers, I've also met lots of viewers as well and it's been fantastic meeting you all and saying hello and introducing yourselves. It's so good and uh, thank you so much everybody who did come and see me and say hello and supporting my channel as well. So thank you so much. It's uh, it's actually quite humbling to meet people that watch your videos. So I'd like to just say a huge thank you to everybody who does support my channel and uh, who came to say hello at the Crick Boat Show. So the sun is shining and it's a fitting end, I think, to the Crick Boat Show. Have you enjoyed it? It's been, it's been a fantastic show. I mean, the weather's definitely helped, but uh, it's been so nice meeting everybody, all of the other boat youtubers or boating youtubers or boat vloggers whatever you like to call them it's been absolutely great to catch up and uh, meet everyone as well and see all the boats and uh, yeah basically have a look and see what's new around the show it's been amazing so um, until next time take care look after yourselves stay safe and i'll see you in the next video don't forget to like subscribe and leave a comment down below take care until next time bye